Whether it's on the field, here comes Tyler Starr, and Starr gets him. or in front of a microphone. I gotta carry some shoulder pads, you know, sing in front of the team. And I'm more than happy to do that. Here comes the rush, Tyler Starr gets him again. South Dakotans know Tyler Starr is a performer. Thanks to HBO's Hard Knocks, so will the rest of the nation. He seems very composed and seems pretty confident, so that should carry well into camp. Right now is the calm before the storm. We're kind of building momentum for a training camp. That's when the fire is at its hottest and this team is forged and it becomes one strong unit. Focusing on the Atlanta Falcons in its ninth season, the NFL film's production goes behind the scenes at training camps and typically focuses on a rookie trying to make the team. The story of a seventh round draft pick from USD is good enough. Such a challenge, especially for guys coming from a small school like South Dakota, Tyler has a cool story. He uh, has really worked hard and has a son, so we thought that was a cool dynamic too. Am I just coming straight out? Yeah. Don't, don't reach for And then of course there's the hair. That makes him such a cool character. People are definitely going to recognize him. I hope they don't make him shave it. It's such a strong part of his identity. I don't think they would. Some rookies might struggle with the spotlight of a camera crew following them all day and into their first training camp. But not Tyler. You got to focus on what you know what the task is at hand, and just let that be the background. This is a little different, just because you know it's not a typical interview. It's kind of like a you know daily process. But um, you know, just just being myself is something that has gotten me this far, and you know I'm gonna continue to be that. And you know, if people don't like who I am, then I guess they can turn the channel. He is, after all, a performer. In Vermillion, Zach Borg, KDLT Sports.